Good morning. Welcome to my channel. And what I want to speak on today is the powers that be, the higher ups, the elites, the language they speak, and the clothes they wear to identify themselves, to let the higher ups know that they're working for them. And what I mean by that is all of our political leaders and things of that nature, allegedly, they speak in codes. Yes, they speak in codes. Did you know that every alphabet has a number to it? Like A is one, B is two, C is three, and so on and so on and so on. They speak in codes, man. Sometimes they speak without speaking. They'll show you with what they're wearing. And some of their colors are Tiffany blue and purple. But notice folks, you're gonna start seeing a lot of these colors coming back in. These are the colors of the Phoenicians, the Phoenician people. Yes, the Phoenicians. And man, what I mean is they speak in codes. And you'll notice that the clothes they wear, it sticks out like a sore thumb. Because a lot of this stuff I've been doing some research on. And it's not good. <laughs> it's not good at all. Yeah, because the Phoenicians, they were people that was back way before the Roman times. They made money from clams. It was like a purple dye that came from the clams. They would sell these clams. Yeah. But now, that signifies these colors that people are wearing. See, when these people you see wearing these clothes, they're letting the higher-ups know that they're working for them. They use hand signs. All kinds of gestures. Yes. But you got to open your eyes and see these things because they're doing things right in front of our faces. But we don't know the signs, the colors, and the gestures. We need to start learning these things so we'll know exactly what people are doing and saying right in front of our faces. Yes. Because I, I never used to be interested in that, but I'm learning a lot about that, you know, from doing a little research. Yes. Speaking in codes and the clothing that they're wearing, man, it's, it's something else, man. I tell you, but like I said, you're going to start seeing a lot of these colors, Phoenician blue. Yes. Tiffany, I mean, Tiffany blue and purple. You're going to start seeing a lot of people wearing these different colors. Yes. And when you see it, whenever you see a checkerboard floor, that's in that rim too. Checkerboard floor. And see, when you see the people wearing the black and white, that's neither good nor bad. Yes. And when you see him wearing the red, that means war. Yeah, war. You can check these out if you want, you know. If you think I'm kidding, <laughs> check it out for yourself. Do some research. Yeah, I'm just trying to keep my people up on things, man. What's going on out here in this world, in this universe. That way you'll know when you see these things. All of it's connected together. These these purple lights, they got out here, all this stuff is connected. 
like I said in the video back a couple weeks about the purple light thing. <laughs> the purple light is connected with the to identify you. Yes, that's what that is for. See, I'm learning all this stuff. I'm doing research on it, man. And I'm glad that I did my research. See, nothing's going to get past my eye, man. I'm not going to let nothing get past me. I'm going to be able to identify everything that these folks are doing out here. See, some people are still asleep, so they don't even know what's what. What's what. They don't know the head from the toe. <laughs> you know, they just living aimlessly, walking around. Whistling Dixie. The town, the day is the time to know.